Hey guys, Grass on here, playing more Cold Path. So last time we were in Norway, um, but I played a lot more in that save file, so it's kind of like too far to really continue. Basically what happened, um, I got an ally, moved in through, uh, like here's the map. I moved in through Holy Roman, uh, the Holy Roman Empire, took most of it, took Poland because they attacked my enemies. And then ended up in a big war with um, the Byzantines, where my allies turned against me as well. And that's when all my allies died, except for a new one that I made. Then we took out the blue guys, then we took out the Spain area, and I ended up... Like, Norway had everything, so it's kind of the end of the... Kind of the end of the difficult game. Here, I'm really struggling. This is, like, really testing me. I'm Sweden in this game. Um, this is where I've gone, and I'm in a war with the Holy Roman Empire. I have no allies... But actually, not only am I in a war with the Holy Roman Empire, I'm in a war with these guys. The Bulgarians, who've, like, um, got a, a vassalage on Pekin... Pekigans? So I had this area here, then they came up and stole it from me. And now I'm in a war just to hold on to Sweden. They also attacked me from the north and tried to come this way. I've held them off for now. Um, I'm recruiting more guys and sending them up here to try and take this area back as we speak. But, yeah, I've been playing this for quite a while now. Um, this is what my map looks like. So I did I did learn a whole lot more about this game, how the thing works. Turns out you just have to like click this for all your options and stuff. At the moment, I, for in science-based, I'm saving for Pessinung, because then it starts to increase your population by a lot. And nothing else is really, like, a helpful natural bonus. Other than that, I'm waiting for an another one of these blue squares, and I'm going to get, um, Optimization 2, an extra 10% money per turn. Which is going to give me between, like, which should give me about an extra, like, 100 per turn, 150 per turn or so. Which might not seem like a lot, but it's going to be a lot. 150 is, like, it's 4 per troop. So, 150 is an extra, like, 40 troops, or 30-something troops. Like, probably 38 or so. So I've been trying to take Denmark from these guys for so long, because they allied with Denmark, but then what happened was, like, I attacked Denmark, killed all the Denmark forces, but the, some of the Holy Roman Empire forces survived. So Denmark died, but the Holy Roman Empire swooped in. And now these guys, the Bulgarians, are technically in charge of it, because they're sending reinforcements around south of here, and they're sending them up to here. So I have consistently controlled these two seas, stopping them from actually getting to my homeland, but I've not been able to take that area. I'm thinking of changing to a defensive strategy because I keep trying to attack, but it doesn't work. Thing is, I don't want I can't ri I don't want to risk um losing this part of Sweden here because this part's an important part in defending my gold mine. So if I could take here, then I could bring the fight to here and I could be defending here, um, Denmark. So I want to try and I want to try and get Denmark. That's the goal right now. Um, so I'm just gonna. Oh, I have no money. Move them there. And move some of these guys up to help with that issue. Leave the rest there. I can't try any sort of attack. I, j I just don't have I don't have a lot of money. I'm like, like I've got like a couple of mines. I've got a mine there. I've got a mine here. That's it. Where's the next um? the ability starting with M. This thing, number three. That's very far ahead, though. Did I get the second one of that, though? I did, yeah. Yeah, so I just have to... So I can't, like, really find more gold now. I have to try and take this area up, up here back. Did I trade with Norway? If I trade, if I have Norway add resources, so if I had Norway add 100 resources of gold, they don't have any gold. Uh, they're minting all their gold, I guess. Well, next, so I'm, I'm, and I keep switching between like getting about 1,500, and how has it been four minutes already? I've been just talking. I've not even done anything. I get between like 1,500 and 3,000 um, money each turn. I can't go out here either, because there's so many Holy Roman, Roman Empire forces, they just destroy my ships. Shit! Oh, fuck! How? 
How it doesn't even how many did they attack with? I had five hundred and a fort there. Oh fuck. Okay, everything I got has to go down down there. a whole lot of space up here. Thing is, I've disconnected them from the top, and they have no more, um, none of these land areas have any population. I don't know how they have more than 90 here. They must have just pooled their forces. They, like, run out of space, though. Or they, they've just run out of people. Because it doesn't let you bring the population lower than 100, 1,000, I mean. This is bad, though. This could, like, lose me the war. I get extra money per turn. Come on. Shit, I didn't take it back. France has ceased to exist. It's all Russia now. Right, Russia, Russia was attacking France. Can I ally with uh, Kevin Roos? Alliance, yes. This, this could, like, save me. I don't know if the game's gonna have, um... I don't know if the game's gonna be nice to me or not, though. Because I'm, I'm Sweden. I'm right here for power. I'm fighting the Holy Roman Empire and Bulgaria, which are both above me. Alliance? Maybe I can, like, do something with them, too. This is looking really bad for me, though. So I might be able to take it back up here, but this is the real problem. Like, this is a fucking disaster. Oh shit, I can't even- oh fuck, I've screwed up. Oh shit, they got forces in here now too. Oh no, I just ran- I've run out of stuff. Oh f oh f holy fuck. What the hell am I supposed to do? I can't, I can't defend any of the rest of my territory. How did they get up here? They came back in from the top? God. I didn't even... How did they kill my 1,200 forces just like that? I think I have to try and surrender. Oh shit, this one had the... Oh, I fucked up. This one had the mine. I need, I need the mine. Oh no, I need I need the gold. Ah... Uh... Just by hitting the recruit button emptily, they somehow get more more people. Oh no, now they're down to a hundred. That's actually decreased the amount of people they have. Strange. How do I not have movement points? What? That's never been an issue before. What the fuck happened? I had like, oh my god, I had like 1,200 men. Oh no, I only had 120 attacking. All my guys are dead. Like, I just lost all my land. They're not, they're not giving me peace. Like, th this game was so unfair. Basically, all I did was, was exist, made an alliance with Wales, the Holy Roman Empire attacked Wales, I was forced to attack the Holy Roman Empire... Wales gave up and just joined them, and I've been just stuck here this whole time. I've been stuck in this war against the stronger civilization. They've been the strongest civilization the whole time. 
They've only just been beat by Kevin Roos. And no one would ally with me. No, none of the other strong nations could actually give me a chance of ally. I've been stuck in this war I couldn't possibly win for so long now. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't give you the option to be a vassal or anything or any, either. There we go. I'm a vassal now. I'm stuck here. I have no population. If I dissolve my army, I'm just barely making money. Look at how strong they are. 2061. And there's like no free land anymore. I'd have to like take a boat up to here. Or over to here. I could try and colonize Ireland and Iceland. Ugh, this is so bad. I literally just... Like, I can't do anything. Poss I, can't po I can't possibly do anything. I can get building. Like, I need, I need to build a, um... I can't build a mine, I can't build a mint. Building a mine over normal ground doesn't give a gold, right? Like, I need a... I need a port, which is going to cost about 5000 I need a bank, which is going to cost 5000 as well. I am totally screwed. There's nothing I can do in this one. I can watch my population slowly rise. It's gone up by, like, three each time. I could increase taxes until I get a bank. I should change to a trade republic so I get extra gold. That's gonna kill my guys. I wish I can get without killing them is like half, not even. Um, trade republic. So I can't change again, but I guess I'm just a trade republic now. It's more expensive for an army. But I'm gonna make more gold. I'm just waiting for a bank now. And pen penicillin as well. That'll in that'll increase my population. Wow, I like. How has it been 13 minutes? What? The fuck happened? Declared war on Norway. Wales declared war on Norway. Sweden declared war on Norway. I can't fight a war. They've got 600 people in my- I'm gonna- oh my god, I'm gonna die. Because the Holy Roman Empire forced me into this, I'm going to die if I don't do anything. No one to fire. Huh. What's Shell do? I died! Fucking holy- they- the holy- they just- they made me their vassal, they forced me into a war, and then I died because I couldn't possibly defend myself. What's the overview? Doesn't work. Jesus Christ! Holy shit! That was... Forced into a war I couldn't possibly win, became a vassal, only to be forced into a war with my previous neighbor and then die because I couldn't defend myself. That's fucking insane. Jesus Christ. Anyway, if you want, if you want to see the other game, um, this is the Sweden one. How do I... Can I load it right before I died? Hey, I'm alive. They've actually sent me support here, too. 
Whoa, they, Norway's already, like, invaded strong. I'm going... I can't do anything. Oh, shit. I have to defend my country or I'm gonna lose. Okay, this, this area, if I look at population, that area actually has a whole lot of population. Now I'll make a lot of money per turn as well. Holy, I'm not going to survive this well. Somehow I'm alive. I did technically die the first time, but in Universe 2, I'm alive. Look at this. They put nine and two people in my, um, in my places. Yeah, that's gonna help. I need to colonize. I need to just save for now. If I dissolve the army, I don't want to dissolve it all. I'll dissolve that army. Put this down at 200. I have to help just co to colonize. Russia's going to war with those guys. This is interesting. Oh, this is going to be bad. So this is the ally structure. So, like, they have me as a vassal and Wales, and these guys have the other team. These guys have gone to war with them. They're neutral with Poland, and they own France. And they've vassaled these guys. So this means it's going to be France, Russia, and those guys down there versus this entire green army. So the entire world is about to explode into war. And I own two provinces. Too bad this, like, went so fast. We're at 17 minutes. I think I'm going to record for probably about 25 safe. Okay, here it comes. Holy Roman Empire, war in Russia. Wales, um, war in Russia. Sweden, war in Russia. I don't want to be war with Russia. Peace. I'm going to die otherwise. Who's stronger? I think the Holy Roman Empire is not quite. But the Holy Roman Empire plus Bulgaria is definitely stronger. Okay, build a port. I already have a port. What else do I have? I can't tell. Build a bank? Building limit reached. Oh. Build a bank there. Bulgaria declared war on Kevin Roos. Made an alliance with the Kingdom of Arles. So the Kingdom of Arles also now is going to be fighting this. Um, they are right against Holy Roman Empire. Is Norway dead yet? Yeah, Norway's dead. This is gonna be chaos. I'm gonna go colonize somewhere. I recruit a thousand people or so. Arles on Bulgaria and Holy Roman Empire. Oh, I can't even go into there. I'm just losing money now. Oh my god. Oh my god, I just lost so much. Oh, there's money here. Thank you. Um, I can't build anything with it. All I can do is dissolve. I got invaded. I got invaded by my own, like, group. Holy crap.
um, diplomacy? I guess caring for population. I got invaded by those guys. All I can do is really wait. I can't even hire an army. Am I technically vassaled? I am. I asked them for money. Oh no, I, I'm, I was trying to ask them for that. Um, them for money. I died! Russia killed me. I couldn't even see enemies on my border. Not, not to mention I couldn't hire an army. This game, Jesus. I got 9 out of 20th. <laughs> Holy crap. The Holy Roman Empire could not start wars, eh? One war after another after another, and then they took my land anyway. I was just, I was stuck fighting the Holy Roman Empire for so long. I've been, I was fighting them for literally like two hours earlier. It's annoying that I lost. I mean, it was bound to happen. Once they just kept bringing in more and more strong guys. Well, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let me know if you want to see more of this game. Remember, if you, if you like, if you like, if you like my content, feel free to like and subscribe. And dusting some. Bye, guys.